Hello everyone, this is Bethel Back in a 7 with disgusting, repetitive, and annoying garbage. Okay, so we discovered last time that we need to have two mimics here, which is really unbelievably annoying and it makes me want to destroy the world, but that's besides the point. So we are going to need to get this first Mimic through which involves clearing all this before there are too many roaches? No! How? How? I hate, I hate this. I, I, I hate this again already. Uh, why? Stefan, you are just the culmination of the worst. Alright. Shut that there. Plus, that was taken care of pretty quickly. <laughs> Not bad. Not bad. Okay. Now the annoying parts begin. Of course, they do. Oh. Yeah, I can't do anything. I don't want to. I wish I could, but I can't. Okay, at least I can try to get through this quicker. With magic powers, maybe? I mean, that's the key to making it through this horde. Uh, that's going to be coming up. Of course, too. Okay. Uh... All right, I need to drop these chapters too. Uh, of course, I do. Oh my god, I hate this. This entire video is just going to be me saying I hate this, in case you wanted to know. So now I guess you don't have any reason to watch this. Aside from seeing why it's the worst thing ever, but and why I hate this, but you know, I think it can be figured out from a glance, don't you think? Okay, I should probably. The biggest problem I have with what I'm supposed to do here is that this horde of roach queens down there is just gonna get unmanageable. Yeah, look at this, this is already going to be a horrible mess. Okay, no, seriously, this is the same problem I faced earlier. How do I kill these roaches? I, I can't even begin to explain how much I hate it, all of this. This isn't a toggle. What? Why does this door toggle? Why? Why would I want this door to toggle? Ugh. God damn it, Doom. Right, not Doom, Stefan. You horrible, horrible architect. What drives a man to such madness? Look at this! Look at this! There's no way I'm surviving that. No, no way in heck. No way, Jose. This is not happening. No, Siri Bob, I'm not making it through that alive. <sighs> that little stupid Tarby be spawning, that's for sure. I can't cut to a tar in time because I'm gonna have all these roaches just after my treasure or something. This is inhumane.
Wait, are you telling me that this door is completely and utterly pointless? That is the meanest trick to play ever. On the plus side, I can actually go here and kill all those stupid godforsaken roaches. Okay. Let me just spin around a bit. No, okay. Uh, Alright. It was a good red herring, I'll give you that. However, it's in a room I hate, so I hate it. That's just how it goes. You can't win. Not if you're making terrible rooms like this one. The only winning move is to make a good room instead of this mess. This it shouldn't be that hard. I mean, maybe like there was a a, 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 a sort of thickness that made it impossible for good rooms to be made in Architects Edition, but man. Actually that's wrong because Jut made a hole in Architects Edition and it was good. What stopped them from making that? I guess it's the archaic uh yeah the archaic way of thinking that these uh, uh that these folks had. I mean yeah, they assume that this kind of stuff is fun. I mean, no wonder. So my mimic got stuck. Oh, of all the things. Stupid mimic is not is no son of mine. This should not be too difficult. In fact, I think it's going to be the easiest part. What? Oh, God. oh, of course. Okay. So now this part is about getting rid of this guy. Okay, there we go. That's what that was for. Okay, so. With this guy in tow, let's make it through here. Nice. Double stab. Let's say I don't want you anywhere near me, stupid mimic. Tainted. With the soul of a horrendous thing. Maybe a demon. Nah, not a demon. It's too kind for you. You mimic. It's the last room and then I'm done. Good riddance. This was just... Since I'm assuming there won't be any more cheap tricks, but then again, maybe there are, but assuming there aren't, I'm gonna give my thoughts on this. This was just horrendous. I mean, there were, there were a few points where I thought this whole thing could be salvaged, and for a while it was. I mean, this room, this room, kind of-ish, that, that room, and this room, even the first part of this room in a way. And yeah, th th there were a few good rooms and good ideas, but this is the kind of thing that really needed a modern perspective to make it good because the execution is the most horrendous I have ever seen 
forcing you to repeat entire rooms if you miss up if you mess up the linchpins. I think I've said it before in a subterra video, but you do not punish the player for not knowing what to do. You reward them for figuring it out. This hold flies in the face of that of that notion completely and utterly. Figuring out the puzzles felt like I was being punished because I did not know better. Oh, that's why you need to hit that orb. Of all the things! Okay, never mind. I'm still stuck and I hate this thing even more. I'm glad we could come to an agreement. Except I'm not because I hate this thing. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. How does a man hate something so much? Well, that's simple. Make a hold with by Stefan. That's how you make a man hate everything. I don't even care about holding back anymore. This is horrendous and the guy needs to be called out for it. This is... Not good level design. Messing up should not involve such a ludicrous punishment. Ever. Oh my god. Is this what losing it feels like? Because I really am. How do I deal with these roach queens? Okay, I need to hit that orb. And I need to get the mimic on the other side. I cannot survive that horde of roaches. I'm gonna... No, hints. I'm not giving this room the satisfaction. No. Okay. I think I have a bit of an idea what I'm supposed to do to get the... To break free of these roaches, it involves a bunch of cowering. Of course. Of course. Indeed, it does. Okay, so. Okay, so I need to position everything in a good way, which I don't think I can do because this is the most hateful thing ever. Yeah, that's why I can't do this, because the level is full of hate. Yeah, whatever, I don't care. I don't care what you have to say. Oh, I'm gonna go up there. Try to not kill the both of them, except I can't because it's stupid. Uh, everything frustrates me, and there's a loud barking dog in the background, and it just makes me want to destroy the world. 
Can I go through one video without wanting to blow up the earth? Seriously? Is that so much to ask? I think it is. Can't fit it just for once. Just for once. Please don't be left and right. Okay. I should be getting there in time. So when I reach this spot, the tar will grow. That's too late. How can I be earlier than that? Okay, I guess I can do that. Maybe I could try to fight them facing the east instead. But no, that's too much time. Okay, come on. Maybe you just need to... I need one, two, three more turns. Three more turns. How do I get three more turns? This is simple. Do this. What? No, I didn't make it. What the heck? One more turn. One more turn is what I needed. I don't know how that was any different. <sighs> That's almost there. I'm almost there. Okay. Alright, got it. You know, the people that I had to do this room in uh, Architects Edition, they had to do it without all the extra features I have today. Okay, now I gotta get out of there, somehow. Okay, there we go, I think. Oh, great. The one place I can cower to, I'm gonna die if I go there. That's a real nice thing. Okay, good. That gives me more uh, room. Okay. okay. Okay, on the plus side, we're done here. Basically, we're... Stop that. This is the meanest thing I've ever seen. Seriously, that door has, has no purpose other than to mess you up. Yeah, uh, Stefan is the most uh, trollish architect ever ex that, that ever lived. His rooms are the purest sense of hatred, of, uh, of goodwill towards mankind for somehow. I'm sorry, but I am not in a mood to even remotely say anything positive. This is... At best, this is terrible. At worst, it's the purest display of hatred. Just pure, unadulterated hatred. But towards what? I'll never know. I know only that there is no love in this. And if there was... 
it was so misguided that it was just simply and utterly misguided because how can this be love? It's like someone that uses uh, that pretends that justice involves killing people. I mean, in the end, you're punishing a crime by committing a crime. It's uh, it's a little, yeah, you know, a gray area, but still very, very odd. But no, seriously, I I am not in a good mood with this thing. Okay, so. I do not have any other stupid things to put up with. I would so presume. Okay. I can just grow already. Okay. Okay. Right. Don't clear the tar, you stupid. Oh my god, I'm gonna hate this so much. Yeah, I already hate it. Oh, naturally, of course, that would be there. <sighs> it's over now, right? No more of this. We don't have to put up with any more ridiculous shenanigans from Stefan. <sighs> Apparently, this guy made another whole dusty dungeon. After playing this, I'm not sure I want to play it. Because if it's just going to be this hate-filled... I'm not going to put myself through more of that. No. Well, I mean, I, I probably will play it, but... I, 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 I just... I have no words for this. This is... I mean, it does stand out from this plethora of very dull hack and slashy holes, you know? Hacky sacky and whatever, but this is the wrong kind of standing out. It's like you stand it's like saying you stand out of a crowd because you killed 13 people. Why did you kill 13 people? Yeah, you stand out. You did something most people wouldn't do, but I guess there's a reason why people don't kill people. That's because that's wrong. I mean, yeah, okay, the, I've taken the analogy to a ridiculous extreme here, but, you know, you know what I'm getting at. This is, this is the wrong kind of standing out. It is the utterly wrong kind. I mean, no, this is... Yeah, I gotta admit, I got really angry at several subterra levels in my time. But, I have to say, I'm surprised that it took this long for me to get this angry at a drawed level. Well, it happened. Are you happy? It happened. It finally happened. How do I even begin? Okay. 
There we go, it's dead and I am done with level th level three. I am done. I hated this. Just so you wanted to know, I if in case you didn't get the message, I hated this so much. Abysmal. And this isn't even the worst, supposedly. There's a room in the late uh, in the later ones that's supposedly even worse than all of these rooms. The, there is much worse out there. I just want to make that clear. This is this is not the worst, apparently. Uh, a user on the forums, Dragon Fogel, has been playing through those uh, through the entries in reverse order, and it gets worse than that, supposedly, according to him. It gets so much worse. And there's a room in Agaricus's entry, the guy who made Bavato, that is just going to utterly break me, and. What did what did Patrick have to say about this guy? This hold was cursed. Amazingly well done. More like amazingly well tortured is what I would say. Sorry, Stefan, but this is this is this was painful to go through. And I played the really annoying hold. <laughs> you know what? At least at least the really annoying hold. Was it was a tongue in cheek kind of thing? This was just painful. I'm sorry. This this has to be the most torturous hole that I've ever gone through. Okay, enough dilly dallying. Okay, abysmal's entry. A hole that start up, starts off with two snakes following you definitely gives you a small burst of panic. I found an easy way to rid the snakes early, although I'm not sure whether it was intended or not. Limits. Infinite madness in finite space. Unfortunately, this is not a calculus theme hold. Okay, so welcome to the hold of limitation. There's only so much you can do. You'll find that here you'll have to wait until the time is right before you're allowed to kill things. Sorry, that's just how things go. Okay, I'm just gonna start going through now. So this is the hold where you have to wait. Okay. Is now the time? Do I have to go back there and wait again? Now my question is what the heck? Opens that and closes that, opens that and closes that. I'm guessing I have to wait for the snakes to be out of my face or something. Okay. Okay, uh, going back to that other hold for a moment, I won't deny that it was good. I won't deny that there was a level of uh, cleverness required to each room. By any other standard, this this would be considered a good room, a good a good a good level. But each puzzle just required so much tedious manipulation and other similar things that I just can't give it a good grade. I I. I I had to redo the puzzles a hundred times it felt like. And forcing the player to restart a room because he did something wrong at the start is not a good does not a good level make. Okay, let me try to race the snakes instead of uh, waiting.
Oh, that's just great. Okay, that, that that did it. I just gotta kill that other snake. So I'm guessing I'm gonna have to do some crazy shenaniganry, which involves both of them dying or something. No, that's just great. Or I could just wait for both of them to. Oh my god, are you for real? Okay. Okay. Dude, are you really going to skip? Man, come on. Just stop being a jerk, will ya? Okay. I'm just gonna... Really? You really got me like that? Okay, I'll try to shove him over there. That should get him to be easier to manipulate. Why does he go that way? Don't snakes prefer to move east? What the hell's wrong with you? Is it because I'm in that direction? Seriously, that's the only thing you're gonna go by? You know what, I'm gonna try to... Oh, that wouldn't work though, because... Okay, what if I... <sighs> How did I manage to do that earlier? Seriously, there was like a magic trick that happened and the snake just shoved himself in there. What happened? Seriously, what happened there? Okay, maybe I need to have him go before me? I'll try to do that. Some scroll shenaniganry. Come on. Oh, okay. This is where we split off, and you go ahead. Okay, good. I'll follow you. Oh, of course you'll just go around in circles because you're a giant dunce snake. Can't do anything for your own sake, can you? Okay. Fine. We have to wait. Why do I have to wait? What do I have to wait for? In all that time, I can just... Okay. Ah, there we go. That does it. Definitely makes things a little much easier. Okay, so, uh, how do I get out of here?
What closes these gates? Nothing? Okay. What? I can't get out? No, I can't. These doors are closed off. No arrow seems to be pointing outwards. No broken walls as far as I can see. I can go back there. What good does that do me? this to open there are no arrows here nothing else Ugh. is this gonna be another one of those entries I feel like I'm not gonna enjoy this. Okay, so I'm not supposed to free these guys? What? Oh, wait, I'm supposed to do this later. Oh, okay. Right, I didn't even notice that this room was uh, not required. Ah, I feel stupid now. Okay. Okay, that's... I should have realized what that actually meant. After everything else is dead, you may use this switch to kill the eyes. It'll help you kill the eyes. Um, what? That seems pretty obvious to me. I mean, if something is meant to kill the eyes, it's probably going to help me kill the eyes. Okay, so what am I supposed to do now? Okay, it's... I don't get it, what's the, what's the point of this? Oh. I really need to get to this guy. Okay, there we go. Room clear. Wasn't too bad. Okay, so this hold will revolve around waiting. Gotcha. Okay, what's this? All X's are approximate. Huh? <sighs> hey, what's that thing we didn't want again? We have it now. <laughs> Why? Just why? 
Plus ideas have not been too hard to manipulate. Open some now. Uh. But seriously, multiple ray three manipulation and visibility potion. You have to be some sort of evil, of evil uh, scientist to come up with something so dastardly. Okay. I'd like if you wouldn't raw run away. Jeez, the one time I need you to be courageous and you don't even come up to the roll. Frankly, I think this will do here. I mean, these are just approximations, as he says, so... Really? You're gonna do this? Oh, I hate those stupid bats! Better not be wrong, because I have no time to do things over again now. Actually, I do have the time, it's just I don't want to have the time to do it again. I put them on your X's. What more do you want from me? Done any killing? this room. Okay. So there's something to the north. Is it that? This is an invisible maze. Turn on your sound. I see. Yeah, no, your maze is not invisible. I have no time to deal with your shenanigans, mister. Seriously, in Architect's Edition, you had to restart the room if you made a single wrong step. See, this is why I don't... See, this is why I am now rejecting the theory that Architect's Edition was ever really worth it. I mean, I could vouch for it before. I mean, 
the that era to me seemed like a simpler time where puzzles weren't as complicated and didn't rely on so much uh, crazy trickery and knowledge and intricate knowledge of the elements. But after seeing all of those things, <laughs> are you kidding me? There was just as much of that kind of stuff, if not perhaps even more of it. <laughs> Stefan's entry proved to me that. Yeah, uh. Architect's Edition was not the good times. Nothing was the good times. The times were never good, they always were terrible. Isn't that fun? Isn't that a fun legacy to leave behind for your ancestry? Seriously, this is stuff you had to figure out yourself back then. No puzzle maze. Heck, even, it, even up until the city beneath, you would have had to click on each and every single eye to figure out where you were going with your life. I mean, I'll admit it's not as bad now, but... Jeez. Who, what drives a man to do such things? Okay, this one closed. That door. Okay, so this. Let's we get to that orb. Okay. Best part of this maze is that there's so much backtracking in it. Oh, did I say best part? You know, I meant worst. Okay. I think I can actually crawl back through there instead. Oh, shut up, you. Oh, well now how do I hit that one? I can get to that snake yet, I need to get to that eye. Well, I can get to that one just fine. Right now. Does that close this? I'm saying I'm not sure why I'd want to close that. Hold on. I'll try to sneak through. Should be capable too. Ah, there we go. Now I have the perfect positioning to kill this stupid snake. A stupid goblin too. Fatty and I is in well trapped. Wow, congratulations, buddy. You're really good at this thing. <laughs> Yeah, I just skipped like half of your maze right there, buddy. Well, I guess I still need to kind of figure out where to go from where, but... Most part, I can kill all, all these eyes. Well, most part. I wish I can hit that orb now. I don't know about that. That one block in particular. Slide that guy over here. Okay, this is gonna be interesting, trying to figure out how to kill everything. What? Oh, you're a jerk, Mr. I. How do I kill anyone? Can't get I can't get past this eye. 
Oh, I could... No, I can't get past this eye either. Everything is blocking that one, so... Okay, I guess I have to start from... Over there. Alright, I'll go there. Small steps, I suppose. Is it on an arrow? No, it's not on an arrow. What? So I can kill this, I can hit this eye without any problems. Same for this one, really. Most of these traps are inconsequential. Wow, okay, that's a uh, good level design right there. Well, that's good, that makes it actually possible to solve. I just gotta figure out which ones I can retract myself from and which ones I can't. Uh, obviously, the only ones I could actually pull myself away from are the ones that are in the way. The only ones that I can't get myself out of are the ones that block me. So... Oh, I need to keep the brain alive exactly for that purpose. Okay, so I'm gonna go back to where I killed that brain. Okay. What close is this one again? This orb? Okay. Let's not kill the brain this time. The brain is good. Brain good. Let me just hit that one. Yeah, okay. So we can proceed in that direction. I'm still pretty certain that I can just cheat my way out even with the brain goblin. Okay, so ignore this guy now. Oh, shut up here. You have no pertinent topics, thoughts on that matter. Okay. Okay, this beam should allow me to do the cheaty thing and just crawl across. Okay, don't kill the brain. Would you just behave? No, I can actually use an evil eye for this, right? You can wake up every single eye ever. Then leave one behind, kill the brain. What? What? When did you get stuck in there? Oh, right, because of stupid, 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 stupid. Okay, all right. Okay, gotta be careful to not have any eyes get stupided into their traps. Okay, good, I can't wait that long. Okay, okay nothing tra- Oi, what'd you get in there? Clear the path. This dude Leo right here. Okay. Okay, I'm keeping this one around. I'm still gonna need the eyes to be brain because I'm killing all but the last one up there. Why'd you get in there? Stupid. Oh my god, these eyes. Right. 
Kill Snake. And I unintended solution this round. Yay! I'm the master of destroying everything. Okay. That's long enough. So I'll end this here. This has been Vithu back in a 7 with uh, with shenanigans the hold. And I'll see you in the next part. <laughs> no, okay, it's uh, it's an unfortunate architect completion. Abysmal Zenshi. And I'll see you in the next part. Have a nice one.